Rated M for Mature. Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Persona 3 FES. And in the previous video, something very startling happened. The chairman kind of went rogue after we defeated the Twelfth Shadow. And, well, Mitsuru lost her father in a freak accident. But we can't let that stop us. We must continue to live on as if nothing happened during the dark hour. I pray that this recording reaches safe hands. That video? My employer has become obsessed with a loathsome idea. And this experiment should have never even been conceived. That's why I had to interrupt it. However, in doing so, I set free a number of shadows that are certain to torment future generations. But if I hadn't, the entire world may have paid the price. Please, listen carefully. I cannot stress this enough. You must not hunt the shadows that have dispersed. Huh? This part's... I wasn't able to stop this madness. He won't listen no matter what I say. He's under the devil's spell. Now the shadows are trying to eat one another. But if they're reunited, then we are all doomed. I'll say this once more. Leave the shadows be. This is the original video. Before Ikutsuki changed it. Dad tried to stop the experiment. There's not much hope for me now. I have just one favor to ask. Whoever finds this, please, give my daughter Yukari this message. I know I promised I'd be home soon, and I'm sorry to break that promise. But I want you to know, Daddy was the happiest man on Earth when he was with you. I love you, Yukari. Please, take care of yourself. Dad? Dad? Daddy? <laughs> I know one thing for sure now. I was right to believe in him. Are you listening, Dad? I'm doing okay. It took a while, but I finally got your message. I'll fight for what I believe in. That's what you would have wanted. Right, Dad? Welcome. As I'm sure you are aware, you are currently in a dream. Now then, there has been a change in you recently. Have you noticed? And I am not referring to your change in circumstances. I am referring to the change in your mentality. That is why I have summoned you here tonight. Going forward, there is one thing you mustn't forget. I see you recognize it. Shall I remind you of your commitment? I chooseth this fate of mine own free will. There is no need to worry. Whichever path you choose, I shall respect your decision. 
However, only you will bear the responsibility for your actions, no matter what end they may bring about. Please, remember that. Well then, I bid you farewell. Yo, Chidori. Sorry about not being able to come lately. A uh, lot's been going on. Hey, what's wrong? So you heard about Takai and Jin, huh? I was planning on telling you. They were your friends, after all. What? That's not it? I'm scared. It hurts. Junpei, what will you be doing in two years? Two years? I don't know. I really haven't thought about it. Why do you ask? Hey, I, I noticed you stopped, you know, uh, hurting yourself. I guess. That's good. I mean, you have such beautiful hands. <gasps> Don't touch me! Oh, uh, sorry. I, I didn't mean to... This is too painful. It used to be fun when you came to visit. But it's different now. Huh? It hurts inside. I... I can't breathe. I... I can't take this anymore. W what do you mean? I, I don't understand. D did I do something wrong? Tell me what it is. Junpei. Don't come here anymore. But... Uh, Chidori... Hmm, seems Junpei is having a couple lady issues with Chidori. Well, their relationship is somewhat complex after all, so a little bit of complications are bound to happen, you know, you know. Anyways, so let us check our social links very briefly. We have maxed out a fair bit of the early game Persona social links, including Emperor, Priestess, Magician, Hierophant, we're pretty close to getting Chariot completed, Fortune completed, Strength is going to get completed this week, and huh, Temperance seems to be one of the lowest despite the Star, Moon, and Sun. So you say we actually spent some time with him, and I think we still have the matching Persona. And yes, we have Okomanishi. So let's spend today with Bebe and see how his uncle issue is going. When was the last time we hang out with Bebe and sewing is my life? Even though my wallet is light, I can... Only by cheap materials, I will work out to make the best kamuno and save my future. Huh, seems he's pretty adamant about saving his life in Japan. Hmm, so far so good, eh? Uh, when my uncle sees this, I know he'll agree with me, but the great Nihon. Uh huh, well, I mean, you're working pretty darn hard, but does he even like kimonos? <laughs> I truly believe that if I work harder, ah! Seems he's adopted the Japanese mentality. I accomplished a lot today with your help, Jane sama Arigato. Thank you. No problem, baby. I'm always here for you, man. So, baby, he's got his mind set. He's gonna make this kimono as good and as intense as it's gonna get. And as a result of his ambition to create an awesome kimono, we're level 8 now with Temperance. Well, gee, I hope uh, baby's uncle will actually let him stay in Tokyo. Because if he... <gasps> Are you kidding me? This quickly. Liz, you know me too well. You know how much I want to destroy shadows, and this is Liz. I'm coming to inform you of a change in Tartarus. I believe a path that was blocked is now open. I thought you'd like to know. I wish you a safe journey. Yes, Tartarus. 
still has floors left to climb, and we're going to be doing so later. Later, I still want to get another social link done, because tonight is the night that will actually be able to complete the tower social link and oh my Mitsuru isn't gonna be here and I hope she's okay I do too Akiko but aside from that we need to go talk to Mutatsu today and level up his social link so Mutatsu uh, it's been a long time since we talked to each other and maybe this is divine guidance uh, the detective called me and said he found my wife and son well that's pretty fast he said they're running a small restaurant I guess it's pretty popular my son's married and his wife's pregnant. That makes me feel so old. <laughs> really? I mean, you should kind of be happy. I decided I'd leave after I saw you. So I'll be going tonight. I won't be back until they've forgiven me. Huh. I'll get down on my knees if I have to. And if my son wants me to sock me in the face, well, that's fine too. <laughs> I've been thinking about what I'm going to say to my wife, even though I'm not good with words. Huh. I'm going to say... I want to recite the sutras of you by my side for the rest of my life. Gosh, that's corny. <laughs> well, how does that sound? <laughs> well, our answer doesn't really matter, but yeah. Aw, oh, come on, kid. You're embarrassing me. <laughs> Mutatsu. Oh, man. You old turd. Yeah, although I'm a monk, I'm still attached to my family. I guess I'm a worldly monk, huh? But I finally faced the fact that I was drinking to hide my true feelings. Hmm. I feel so free now. He's free fall. No, now's not the time for that. It's all your fault, kid. You remind me of my son. It's all your fault, you stupid, your stupid hair. Maybe Buddha sent you to help me. I gotta admit, I believe in fate. If I hadn't met you, I'd never see my family ever again. Mm. Oh, you kid. Dang. So just by talking to this drunken guy, just sitting on a stinking bar. At night, we really changed his life, and now he's going to reunite with his family, and hopefully they will forgive him. And <gasps> wow. No way. When we get to rank 10 with Arcana, we get different music, and the bond has nurtured maturely. The inner power of the Tower Arcana has been set free. We bestow upon you the ability to create Shit You, the ultimate form of the Tower Arcana. Yeah, we maxed out to the second nighttime social link. That's actually all of them. And the unusual monk social link has been maxed out. You have mastered the unusual monk social link. And now we make power persona or tower persona. It's gonna be stinking strong. We're gonna fight the shadows as strong as they can. Yeah. And the tower social link is at its maximum level. You can create Chi Yu, the warrior king. He's kind of like a Chinese dude. Oh, Matazu actually stood up. Dang, he's actually kind of tall. Here, take this. It's a goodbye gift. Uh-huh. If you only receive the reverse tag. When you mix Contre with white rum, lemon juice, and ice, you get a cocktail called XYZ. Movies and mangas often use initials XYZ to symbolize the end of something. <laughs> but I think of XYZ as the best. <laughs> Plus, it tastes so good going down. Yeah, well, thanks for the tag, buddy, but uh, I don't really think I'll be needing that. I'll be praying that your future is XYZ. So long, kid. So long, Mutatsu. <laughs> You're my favorite social links to me. I'm gonna miss you, dude. <laughs> but yes, Mutatsu left with his head held up high, and we have his item now. And wow, after a lot of talking to Mutatsu, we convinced him to go back to his family, so that old drunk of a monk... We eventually got to understand that he's in fact was being a drunk and he now wants to go back to his family so we can only hope the best for him and his relationship with his wife and son but anyways enough of that I mean you know the story was great and all but we have a lot of other people we gotta help let's look at our social links again so tower and the devil have it maxed out that means we never have to go to Polonium Mall ever again to do a social link I told you those were gonna fly by really fast and indeed they did we also have Death, The Hanged, and oh, Yuko, the team manager. When was the last time we hung out with her? I think today will be an awesome day to finish off that social link. So what do you say we do that? And oh, she's blushing. Mm, since we have a, a monkey with a saber, we should hang out with her and see what she's doing. You want to come to my house again? I have something to give you. Please. <laughs> Uh, here we go again. We're inside a girl's room. When their parents are home. This isn't good. 
sorry. Couldn't give you this at school, but I made an excuse to see you. Well, why'd you have to make an excuse to see me? Now you're making me feel guilty. <laughs> uh-huh. Remember the kids we coached? How could I forget them, Yuko? They're like our kind of children. They're kind of mouthy, but they have their moments. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> that's true for all kids, though. And you're sweet, Johnny Coon. You'd be a good father. Uh, what are you getting at? You, I don't like where this is going at all. Here, this is for you, Johnny Coon. And we got the kid's letter. Neato. Uh, they told me to give it to you. Aren't they cute? Yeah, they have their moments, I guess. That's why I called you up. It's my excuse for inviting you over. Oh gosh, she's blushing. No. Not again. No. Today my parents are at home. Uh-huh. Could you elaborate? I'm not seeing. Don't make me say it. Uh-huh. Quit staring at me. I know my face is all red. Well, now it's not because you changed expression. <laughs> uh, you helped me find my true calling, Johnny Coon. Um, I'm so glad we met. I want to give you a special thank you. Oh, guys, no. Can you stay with me a while longer? Uh-huh, Yuko has expressed her love for our main character. Uh-huh. So yeah, the Strength Arcana, we started it out very early, and now in November, we're kind of maxing it out. And the power of the Strength Arcana has finally been maxed out and set free. We can now create Siegfried, the ultimate form of the Strength Arcana. Kind of funny, we maxed out two physical attacking Arcanas back to back, kind of cool. And the Team Manager social link is now finally over, and we've established a link that cannot be broken. We get the idea. Can we move on and skip this awkward scene after? Well, I guess uh, it's not really awkward. I guess it's just kind of I don't know. Anyway, can now if you seek free the bearer of victory. Yeah, who's an extremely strong persona, but we'll get into that a little bit later. <gasps> she has a heart. Oh gosh, we shared a special moment with Yuko. Mmm. Well, that happened. But now we can summon Siegfried. Now, who is Siegfried? Well, for those who don't know, I'd probably put him as one of the most broken personas in the game. We'll probably get into that later once I have the proper setup to fully use him. And yeah, since we don't have to go to Polonium Mall anymore and we basically have max stats, I'm just going to show it off again because I like to brag. So all the nighttime social links are completed. We're a genius and we're charismatic and courage is at its max. What do we do? What do we do for the rest of the game? Well, pretty much just go to bed and that's pretty much it. It is Sunday, there is no school, that is the joke, because there's no school. And just like every other Sunday, pretty much towards the end of the game, we're going to be hanging out with Akinari at the shrine. I hope you guys are ready for another field trip, because it's going to be one of those ones. I got really into reading a book last night and never went to sleep. I thought I'd be fine since I have so many nights when I'm unable to sleep because of my illness. I guess my condition won't improve if I keep taking chances, though. It's definitely true. Come on, Akinar, you can't die yet. Goodness. Yes, I suppose I need to apologize. You haven't maxed out the social link yet, and that'd be rather rude of me. <laughs> I'm just playing. I came all this way because I was hoping to find you. Well, I kind of do come here every Sunday. And remember how I talked about reading stories? There are plenty of stories, but I think reading them will ever be will make me feel better. The problem is, all those stories are written for someone else. Really? They weren't written for you? I mean, I think they were kind of written for you. Huh. He's trying to say something selfish. I'm being selfish about you, too. You're always coming to see me, and I take up a lot of your time. How much of your valuable time have you, you visit on me? I don't deserve it. You're spoiling me, I'm afraid. Not at all, dude. I don't mind coming here. So Akinari is apparently super duper stinking depressed because he thinks we're wasting time on him, which is a total lie because he's our friend. We want to spend time with all of our friends. It doesn't matter if you're sick or dying. You're still someone in my life, Akinari, and we're going to keep coming back here.
All right, everyone. Today we have yet another transfer student. As you all know, this is our third. That makes it a hat trick. Please introduce yourself. My name is Ryoji Mochizuki. I would be grateful if you could show me the ropes. <laughs> hey, this kind of cute. I was thinking the same thing. <laughs> What's so loud? Nice to meet you. Ryoji lived overseas for a long time because of his parents' work. So he may not be used to all of our customs. Be sure to explain them to him. Now then, you need a seat. Let's see. Oh, that one's open. Second from the left in the front. Um, Miss Toriyumi, technically that seat's taken. You must be present to be a member of this class, so as far as I'm concerned, that seat is available. Life is nothing but a game of musical chairs. The rest of you should be careful, too. Good morning. I'm sorry, I didn't catch your name. You are dangerous. Dangerous? I haven't even asked you out on a date yet. A date? Mm hmm? I guess, what's wrong with you? <laughs> Rejected from the start. You're an interesting girl. <sighs> Your teacher understands, I guess. You haven't had very long to be the new student, and already you have to share the spotlight. I wish your classmates would pay attention to me for a change. Hey, are any of you even listening? So it seems we have a foreign exchange student named Ryoji. Seems like a pretty cool dude despite him hitting on I guess, which is definitely my job, but anyways, let's talk to him and see what he's doing. Hey, you must be Johnny Coon, right? Nice to meet you. Wow, I never dreamed there would be so many cute girls at this school. Oh, you're one of them, huh? <laughs> and yeah, he's pretty cool, but Mondays suck. But you know who doesn't suck? Well, Kari sucks. That segue doesn't really make any sense. But anyways, let's spend some time with her because I'm pretty sure I still have a... Ma no, I don't have a matching persona. So I'll be right back once I grab a pixie from the mall, which sounds really weird out of context. <laughs> and okay, now that I have my lover's persona, let's see what uh, Yukari is up to now that, well, actually she has a new persona, Isis. I wonder if she's going to say anything about that. Probably not, she'll probably keep it secretive, because she's kind of like that. And okay, Yukatan, mm, this is so good. I made the right choice getting the same thing as you, Janiku. <laughs> doesn't eating fish remind you of the ocean? I mean, it doesn't really remind me of volcanoes, so... Uh, sure. Hey, after this is all over, why don't we go somewhere different like the mountains? In the mountains! We could have a lunch outdoors, maybe we could see a deer or something. A princess Mononoke, okay, and then the deer tries to kill- Alright, no, I think that's a different movie. Really, you promise? Yeah, absolutely, Yukari. After this is all done, we're gonna go to the mountains. Yeah. I might not look like it, but I'm actually a pretty good cook. Why don't you help out? Why don't you help out Fuka? Why do I have to eat it? Jerk? There'll be just the two of us, Johnny Coon. No one else. <laughs> and yeah, when I'm with you, Johnny Coon, I don't feel so alone. Well, no, duh. I mean, there's two people. I mean, I do have friends, but there's everybody at the dorm. Usually I feel like the real me is trapped somewhere deep inside. Maybe it's because of my family. Each time I open my eyes, it seems like I'm one step behind. Dang. When I'm with you, I don't feel that way. Well, that's good. Right back at ya. You can, you can, uh, cool. 
Yeah, it's a little deep, I guess. I don't really know how to comment on that. Just, <laughs> I guess Yukari is slowly becoming more attached to us as we spend more time with her. And as a result of eating fish, I guess, we're level 7. Yay. The mountains, huh? Seems like Yukari doesn't really like living here. I guess, but hey, that's understandable. Some people are really sick of where they live, and what do you think of that Ryoji kid? He's going around asking every girl he sees. Dang, I wish I was had his kind of guts. He had my kind of courage. Uh, not another one. <laughs> Poor Yukari. <laughs> I'm, I gotta admit, that was a pretty funny line. And do we go to Tartarus yet? No, I still want to do one more social link, I think. Wow, it's been like six days, almost a week since we've seen Mitsuru. Hope she comes back to school soon, and Ryoji apparently isn't here either. Huh, seems like a lot of people aren't here. Where the crowd? Who, 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 what social link are we gonna do? Well, we're gonna do probably the most dependable guy. All around, a pretty nice dude, our boy, Bebe. Our boy? No, our boy, Bebe. Is always here when we need someone to talk to, so... Actually, I think he needs to talk to us more than we need to talk to him. So we'll see how his whole issue is going. Yo, baby! What's up, bro? If I get my very best, this will come out great! And it seems baby is talking to himself while sewing. Yeah, I guess I'm a little hot up for no reason. Uh, that team of you has been transformed! I... my French expression is... Everywhere. Her impression, not expression. I'd probably be back on already. Now I'm Italian, apparently. I don't know what's going on with baby's voice. Who knows where it comes from? I don't know. It's supposed to be French, but... Because of you, Johnny-sama, I was able to finish this kimono. Dude, you did all the hard work in my country. Is there, is there nothing there for me now. I have to put end to this, so that I can die here in Nihon. Oye! But there you by the way, Johnny-sama. I have met many people in Nihon. Really? You have friends other than me? But you are the best Tomodachi. I have Tomodachi? Tamagachi? Baby, are you crazy, man? I will tell her about the wonderful friend I have made. So I don't know these foreign words, I apologize. But Bebe has basically said, despite all the friends he's made in Japan, we're still his best. Kind of right back at you, Bebe. I'll probably just tell you that, even though it's not true. And pretty much Junpei's my best friend. But Hey, whatever, Temperance level 9. I ain't complaining. And wow, because we hanged out with Bebe for a pretty long time, I guess he kind of learned about Japanese culture a little more and made some other friends and hey I guess how's it going and hey she just returned to the dorm she looked really tired so I doubt she's gonna come to Tartarus with us and yeah she'll be fine we'll just let her be and you know, for a little while yeah I hope so too I guess now let's see is everybody here who looks like it guess we're going to Tartarus tonight yeah buddy so we did a lot. We maxed out the Tower Arcana. We maxed out Strength. We got Sun to level 5. We talked to Bebe for a ton. We actually did a ton, actually. We met our new transfer student, Ryoji. But in the next episode, let's play Persona 3 FES. We're going to climb to the fifth block of Tartarus. So see you guys then. Bye.